I'm Eleni Angelotti. I am a faculty member at the Pointer Institute. I teach about social media and digital trends and also the intersection of technology, journalism, and the law. Well, the big headline has been increasing the quant so getting more of a quantity of quality. How we go from this environment where you have trusted news sources to this environment where everybody's a publisher and how do we vet and verify that information, identify the inherent biases when you know the government or corporate voices can be direct publishers of this information. So how do we hold them accountable and help people make sense of this information that they're directly publishing? So how do we help people um, vet and verify this information because they're able to consume it directly from these direct publishers and so there's less of a need for journalists to do that but there's even more of a need for journalists to do that because um, people can consume this information directly. Traditionally, objectivity is such an important journalistic value, but in social media, transparency seems to be more of an important value so we can know where that information is coming from, know what the source of that information is. And that, so it's more, mostly like, transparency is over, an overriding value that's kind of a pressure point when you're facing um, you know, all these sources that are out there. Well, because there are so many journalists who, it's more of a, like, I think the conversation comes down to um, what are the skills that, that journalists use, and so how are journalistic skills being used, rather than I am a journalist as a role. So it's kind of a, a role versus skills, and so people, even if they aren't working for a news organization, they can still be practicing journalism, but, and this is my opinion, so they can still be practicing journalism, so they might be doing it for a corporation or they might be yeah. doing it for a public relations company whereas before those people weren't seen as journalists but so many people in outside of journalism are former journalists who have journalistic skills that they're using and who's to say that they're not journalists and who's to say somebody who tweets a picture of a plane crash isn't a journalist yeah. but if they are doing journalism so it's gone from who is a journalist to what is journalism and who's doing it so